But on to tonight. Everyone knows the pedigree is the most devastating move in the WWE. Tonight's challenge is the finisher marathon. Each of us will be in the ring for three minutes and we'll see how many times we can hit our finisher. My pedigree, Cena's throwback, and whatever Big Show does these days besides grunt. Whoever hits theirs the most gets the point. Did I mention the ring will be surrounded in flames? Now then, it's time to play the game. Wait a minute. Triple H just willingly let himself be surrounded by flames and face four superstars that want to destroy him? The King of Kings, no pedigree! The momentum is all with that man right now. I love that double-A spine button. Just when the game needed it, he played that big card. A pair of aces. Clubbing axe handles. Unloading with that kick to the midsection. Damn! Pedigree! They don't get much bigger than that. Serious here. expired for Triple H. And that was certainly a lot of pedigrees. I've never seen so many in one night. That was awesome. John Cena is up next, ladies and gentlemen. Time has run out on John Cena, and he could not top Triple H's score. If the Big Show can't beat it, the game will take the point in the finisher marathon. And we'll see Big Show in action next. Big Show dished out plenty of choke slams, but it wasn't enough. 
Yeah, baby, Triple H takes the challenge. That's a score for SmackDown. Next week, the challenge will emanate from the whole of Big Show, ECW. What will Show have in store? I'm John Morrison, and four out of five dentists wish that they could be me. What about the fifth one? There's no accounting for taste. And I'm the guy your daddy tried to bribe to take you out. The Miz, welcome to the Dirt Sheet, live on ECW. Since this is the third week of the Champions Challenge, we were going to recap things. As you can see, Big Show pities his poor excuses for competition and is giving them a head start on whatever will go down at WrestleMania. Of course, it won't be enough for either Triple H or Cena, but Show is just that merciful of a giant. Since it's painfully obvious, Big Show is the better man. Not to mention, he has much cooler friends. True. For tonight's Champions Challenge, he decided to handicap himself. In his match tonight, one of his Champion of Champions opponents will choose whether Big Show cannot run, cannot reverse attacks, cannot attack a downed opponent, or cannot use his finisher. To make things fair, both Cena and Triple H will have one of these same handicaps imposed on them. But it's not like they're gonna win anyway. So sit back, put your arm around your imaginary girlfriend, and watch our gigantic amigo, Big Show, dominate yet again. Be jealous. Well, Cena made a smart choice. But about the only way you're gonna slow down Big Show is with a cement truck. Big Show has set the precedent, and now we'll see how John Cena does. Triple H will be selecting his handicap in the match. Yeah, these two have been buddy-buddy with each other as of late. I, I hope the game doesn't throw him a softball. Cena's overtaken Big Show? I knew Triple H was going to give him an easy handicap. To beat Umaga with so much against you, Cena is one impressive superstar. Yeah, shut your face, hole, Grisham. This night is ruined for ECW, and you're kissing up to John Cena? Have you no pride, man? 